yes, I did go ham on that uh, Bakugan stuff because I'm not going to be the type of uh, influencer or try to be the the yes person, the yes man, the yes woman, the yes person of a uh, company and product. I want to be honest and I'm going to be a critique. I'm going to be a, I'm going to critique and I'm going to be a critic for products. I have a lot of the cards. I have a lot of them. Like, most of them are on my desk right now. Here, all the way here, because I'm trying to make a deck. That's from the Vestroya series, the Vestroya um, TCG set, and I love this card game. It actually got me out of uh, uh, a very bad place in my life, and I am going to play this game. Uh, especially, I am definitely going to tag uh, Spin Master and the official Bakugan and TikTok account. And this game means so much to me because I was very depressed. I didn't know what to do with my life after a, a personal situation went down. And I've met Kimbo through online, and even through online with Kimbo, we even done, like, non-Bakugan-related stuff. Like, we would help call each other during um, wrestling uh, pay-per-views, and we would just have fun. We would laugh. We would talk about what's happening in Beyblade and Bakugan, and I love this community a lot. I'm just stuck right now trying to upload videos to the Aurelis Gagas YouTube YouTube channel. I have uh, something did arrive for me that I bought myself. I do everything myself. I buy it myself, and it comes out of my own pocket. It sucks that the community is a really good community, but they all seem to like only want to help themselves instead of helping each other even though that's the motivation that we speak. I have a throne wish list specifically for Bakugan for people to send me stuff because doing things out of my own uh, money bank account is bad. That hurts me. And I'm really wanting to have more, uh, more variety within Bakugan, but how can I if not many people want to involve others but still speak, speak that they want to involve others. I don't get it. 